The Opportunities Party leader Gareth Morgan is defending his use of the term lipstick on a pig, which he says refers to the change in Labour's leadership and not specifically to Jacinda Ardern. Mr Morgan has come under fire after tweeting over the weekend that the Labour leader should be required to show she's more than lipstick on a pig, the pig being the party. He says it has nothing to do with Labour's leader personally, but rather it's directed at the party's lack of policy. Jacob McSweeney reports... Gareth Morgan voiced his frustration with personality politics at a media conference today, saying neither Labour nor National had addressed rising inequality. He says mental illness and youth suicide are also up, but he's frustrated by a superficial focus on politics. The Labour Party without substantial policy remains just the same old establishment party that actually started all this rise in inequality back in 1984 and has had ample opportunity to do something about it and has done nothing. Mr Morgan came under fire over the weekend after a Twitter user questioned him about personality politics. The Opportunities Party leader's Saturday night response was... All that matters is policy. Jacinda should be required to show she's more than lipstick on a pig. Will she be? The tweet drew heavy criticism from people accusing Mr Morgan of being sexist. The National Party leader, Bill English, was less than impressed. I think they are deliberately appalling com comments. Uh, look, if you've got an attitude like that, I don't think any politician, anyone in public life would want to work with them. Um, you know, that's outside the acceptable boundaries of political criticism and language, and I, but I think he knows what he's doing. Yeah. I think he's designed, designed the comments to stir up attention because he hasn't had much lately. But Gareth Morgan says he made the comments to get cut through because attention was not being paid to his party's policy. That's the world of sensationalism now, five-minute headlines. That's what you have to do to get cut through so we can actually have a discussion about policy. So the challenge I've got to Labour is can we please see the policy on climate change so it can be critiqued. Ms Ardern says she's not bothered by Mr Morgan's comments and invites him to read Labour's policy pages on its website. She says it's the type of criticism she's come to expect on the campaign trail. I'm happy to add Gareth Morgan to our email list so that he gets updates on all of our policy announcements because sadly it looks like he's been missing out on them. Gareth Morgan, however, remains unapologetic, saying he took inspiration from Barack Obama, who used the term in 2008 to describe his Republican opponents. He says he stands by his comments and firmly believes they will help his party edge from its current polling of 2.4% closer to the 5% threshold. For Checkpoint, Core Jacob McSweeney, Aho.